They're not the most fashionable of glasses, but this pair of specs may reinvent the world of wireless computing. Loomis Limited's prototype miniature video projector turns glasses into a personal video screen at the click of a button. Light waves travel through fibre optics within the lenses and are enlarged and directed at the eyes. The illusion of an 87-inch screen appears in front of the wearer's eyes at a perceived distance of three metres. It's the brainchild of Yakov Amite, Loomis's CEO. The principle of this device is quite simple. A video image is created inside this black box. This image is then inserted inside this thin glass and then coupled out into the eyes of the user in such a way that he sees a gigantic screen having a three-dimensional image floating in the air. Once the prototype is developed, users should be able to view videos, play games and surf the net. The company says it will incorporate augmented reality applications to allow facial recognition. Cameras could be embedded so wearers see who they're talking to inside the glasses, even if they're on the other side of the world. Business development manager Ari Grobman hopes the glasses will be on the market by 2014, after they've been redesigned to fit modern fashion trends. This is a prototype. You could easily cut the wire, have uh, wireless connections embedded in here, you know, wirelessly talk to your smartphone. So that's definitely possible, as well as the aesthetics. I mean, we believe that this is our optical engine module is actually small enough. You could have a very natural look and uh, consumers won't be afraid to walk around in public, you know, uh, very non-dorky. You could actually make it something pretty cool. Loomis is in talks with cell phone and gaming companies to develop the technology, already used in US Air Force F-16 fighter jets. The miniature video glasses are not restricted to those with poor sight. Anyone can wear them. And the company believes that when they've been manufactured, the public will find them very easy on the eye. Jim Drury, Reuters.